Welcome to the Quantum Wellbeing Show, guys. It's so good to see you here. Um, whether you are here, I see you in the chat room. Uh, whether you're here live or whether you are on the replay, I'm so grateful that you joined us. So grateful for all of the times that you have joined us and will continue to join us on Broadcast Team Alpha. You know, there's so much more than just my Quantum Wellbeing Show. There's the Paranormal Show that Augie does on Sunday night at 8 p.m. And of course, there's the Tuesday show at 8 p.m. Um, on, on Tuesday. And and they you know, there's all different themes that gets mixed and, and curated. And uh, it's just, you know, Broadcast Team Alpha is really pretty cool. You know, five, six years ago, Augie was doing the universal consciousness show and i went on there as a guest we had a you know we had a a, a chance meeting on facebook and um i went on his show and and i don't really even remember exactly how it happened um but then tom tom appeared and before you, we knew it, the three of us were collaborating and Broadcast Team Alpha was birthed. And it's been it has been such a fun ride. You know, there's been many changes and uh, transitions and evolutions. Uh, and, um, and I'm going to talk about some more changes tonight. Um, speaking about giving birth, um, my life doula ism, my life doula work has really just flourished. And I love the words life doula because it encompasses everything that I do. And if you're new, if you're new tonight, I'm Nori Love. Uh, my co-host is Augie Nast. He's of course, um, not on the Friday night show as I'm not on the Sunday show. Um, so life doula is so perfect because it encompasses that I bring almost 30 years of nursing to my business. I bring my double certification in life coaching I bring hypnotherapy, I bring Reiki and the Silvers modality and Helix healing that I created. I bring all that to the table. And it recently, when those words were gifted to me, thank you very much. Um, it's like everything clicked and it just got really busy and I get to do it all together with some people. Like I get to do everything with them. Uh, and then, of course, with other people, I do a lot of personal training, right? Because you can't get to the spiritual stuff if you're not taking care of your body. So with many people, it starts with personal training, getting the body fit, then moving into the other areas. So I get to do it with some people. I get to do all of it. And then with other people, I get to do hypnotherapy, just life coaching, right? It separates out and it's amazing. But on top of all of this that I'm doing, I actually have caregiver burnout. I've been taking care of um, my godmother who is 86 years old. And um, I recognize the signs Right. When I took a breath one day, I recognized the signs and I'm like, whoa, you know, I'm I am just overloaded and I need to make a change. And that's what the announcement is going to be tonight. Let me just check the chat room, see what you guys are doing. You know, we have the membership, um, the membership group here on YouTube and Augie is chucking it full chucking is that a word chock full he is filling it with all kinds of uh videos and information and uh, um and i will be adding to that i'm going to tell you about that in a little while i can't seem to get down to the bottom of the group chat hang on guys give me one minute so sorry so there it is okay and i don't see any of it okay 
All right, there it is. Hey, guys. Hi, Margaret. Hi, Marius. Hi, Lind. Hi, Nance. All the usual suspects are here. So good to see you. So uh, what really happened in addition to a, a big spiritual upheaval, which so many of us are going through, is that I realized that I wasn't really nourishing my soul. I wasn't fulfilling my obligation to myself that I teach people to do in my business. And I wasn't doing all the things that make my heart sing. So I had the spiritual upheaval and, you know, I'm, I'm on the other side of the pain that comes with that. Um, you know, you, you go through, you climb that mountain. And when you're at the peak of the mountain, that's usually when you're in the fetal position, you know, on the floor. And then, then things, you know, the pressure begins to lighten up and you have a wider view, right? You have a greater, um, a greater expansiveness. You can see further than when you were in all that pain. And, then you can begin to organize. And that's kind of where I am. And I've decided that I'm going to take a, a spiritual sabbatical. I'm going to take three months to myself. And I have very specific things that I am going to do and people that I'm working with. And I'm really excited. Um, I will be... Linda said, I found BTA in 2018. Yeah, I think we started in 2017, Lind. I think we started there. I will be doing videos that are recorded, you, you know, short, the way I like to keep them, maybe even shorter than what I've been doing here. Um, and Mac will air them and they will go in the membership group. They'll go somewhere. Mac will take care of all of that. And we actually have a new team that's that's forming. So, so there's lots of changes. And I'm sure there's lots of changes in your life as well, right? I mean, everywhere you look, change is happening. And it's happening here. So I'm going to be taking three months to myself. And just having made that decision, I could take a breath. You know, I felt like I had cinder blocks on me that I didn't know that were there. There was such a heavy weight. And as soon as I made that decision, and it took a long time to make that decision, you know, it's it was really a lot of feeling into it and being quiet and observing and talking it out. And so there, there was a lot coming. Um, there was a lot that came into play making this decision. But I'm really excited and I'm really light. And I feel like, myself for the first time in a very long time very long time and you know you could actually probably follow the progression on our shows you could go back and watch some videos with mac and there are some videos i mean with tom uh there are some videos that if you haven't seen them or if you are new to broadcast team alpha i mean the uh the videos with uh jordan maxwell amazing amazing jordan is no longer here with us and he actually discussed his intention to leave the planet on one of our shows he actually you know broke the news that that he was going to make a change and go celestial uh, on one of our shows so you can kind of go back and you could probably track you know where the heaviness came in for me if you're that kind of person that likes to study people that way there are many of us who like to do that right so so that's what's going to happen um augie is going to do what he's doing you know and keep guests going i think i'm gonna i'm going to be doing two more shows um the Tuesday show coming up and then a really cool exclusive, I mean, like massive, exclusive, exciting off the charts 
exciting um, uh, recording that we're going to do with uh, Grandmaster Wolf. So that's going to be a really incredible show. And that will be my last one for a while. Um, I did have some commitments like over at the Conscious Awakening Network. And I'm going to talk with Sheila to see if I will do the hosting through the month of November. I'm not sure yet. I need I need to talk with Sheila and really understand the needs there. And um, and then in January, when I come back, Conscious Awakening Network's going to have a, a big. Well, I, I don't want to. I don't want to do a spoiler alert, but they're going to have a really cool uh, flurry of information and education and and uh, entertainment that will be really great for the new year. So so I will be part of that as well. And I'm going to do some fun things with my girlfriends, right? I'm going to do fun things that are really light, really airy, that doesn't require a lot of preparation because all of my focus and preparation is going into this spiritual sojourn that I am taking. And it includes, you know, it includes getting really, really strict with food, you know, with getting, getting my food right, getting my exercise right. A lot of the things that took a hit because I've been so busy and I'm sure you guys all know how that is. You know, you wake up one day and you're like, oh my God, I feel like I got hit by a truck. What happened? And then you look back and then you make some changes or you don't. Right. But, but when when the pain of change comes knocking at your door, like, um, Nori, you need to do something. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll get that. I'll get that door in a minute. You know, then it might go away for a little while. But it's when it's time for you to make a change, it's going to keep coming, except it starts getting louder, you know, and then eventually somebody's banging on the door. And by that time, the energy in your life is such a mishmash, right, that you really, really have to make a change. And that's what I went through. There's some little creature in here. Uh, that's what I went through. And I'm so grateful for it. I love change. And I know not everybody can say that. Uh, maybe it has to do with, you know, Aquarius, with Aquarius rising. I don't know. But I'm really good with change. Although I'd be lying if I said that this was an easy decision, you know, and I'd be lying if I said little, little, little feelings of holy crap, what, you know, what am I doing, you know, <laughs> comes in. And of course, those are those are small and they're far, uh, they're far between. Um, and I'm not really going that far. You know, I'll still be around. Um, you guys all know how you can reach me. Um, my email address is norilove1111 at email.com at gmail.com, email.com. Um, you can text me. 757 uh, country code one seven five seven three two three five 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 eight and if you just want to talk with me you've got something going on if you want to have a consultation with me i will be around i'm still going to be doing my life doula ship is that a word life doula ship um my life doula what would it be called practice right my life doula my life doula work it is the work of my heart. I mean, I just can't even tell you how it makes my heart sing. There is very little, maybe nature, very little that I love more than helping people. Then, you know, I'm, and the array of people that I'm blessed to work with right now is so amazing. You know, I've got people in their 70s that are reaching physical fitness peaks like you would not believe that you would see in somebody in their 40s. Um, I'm working with people who are uh, at, en at end of life and, uh, you know, going through the beauty of, of the song that gets played then. And I'm just, I'm just so blessed guys. And, you know, and I am blessed to be able to help to take care of the 86 year old Christian mystic, 
who passed her mantle on to me, you know, and her passing the mantle, of course, was part of the catalyst, part of the catalyst that shook, you know, my spiritual um, awakening. How many do we have? How many do we get to have in one lifetime, you know? So, so that's what's happening. And I don't really know what else to say. Um, Margaret said, I started watching when Tom was on. Yeah. So I'm still in touch with Tom. And, you know, Tom and I keep kicking the can down the road, you know, kind of threatening each other to do something, to just do something fun. So who knows? You know, I, I will show up <laughs> wherever it's light and the energy is effervescent for me. And it's probably going to be more where it is uh, spontaneous rather than planned because the 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 schedule is is just very very demanding right now and i'm often on call with my clients like my client who's at end of life i'm often on call and um it 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 pulls my energy in different directions and that's not what feels good right now I know you guys understand. So Maria says, greeting, shining ones. We are grateful. I can hear your voice, Mars, <laughs> for broadcast team alpha. Thank you. Yep. So everything else is going to continue the same as usual. And uh, I'll see you guys in different arenas. You know, make sure if you're not friends with me on Facebook, I, I have some spaces left. You can friend me there. And then I've got all my other pages, but I'm going to be culling those pages down into one page, right? Which will be my, my life doula page. Or if uh, I choose a different word behind doula, Right. I'm, I'm, we're kind of kicking that can down the road, too, to see what what the most um, resonant, you know, harmonic descriptive would be for that. So that's all I've got, guys. If you've got any questions, um, just put them in the chat room. If not, you know how to reach me. Um, Matt, Mac, can you put my email address in the uh in the dialogue and I'll put my phone number in there so that if you guys want to text me, you're welcome to. There we go. All right. And I just want to thank you. You know, I want to thank all of you for going on the journey that began almost six years ago with us and, and, Thank you for staying on the journey as we evolve, as we evolve, right? Energy moves in a spiral as we evolve into the new, what would the word be? Into the new expressions of who we came to be and what we came to do. That's all I got, guys. Much love to all of you. Thank you so much. Take good care of each other. I'll see you around.